That was a good one. Previously on Trio, Chris's mom joined Trio aboard Saltair 3. And together we visited the swimming pigs of Staniel Key. <laughs> We dropped the anchor in the beautiful bay at the laid-back settlement of Black Point. Well, that's a big one. Yeah, he's pretty. And we went spearfishing he's for lionfish. He's scary too. It's pretty scary. Yeah. We gotta stay tight to this little island here. In this episode, here. we navigate the extremely South shallow Pinnacle. waters of the Exuma Banks. We do an afternoon hike up to Perry's Peak, the highest point in the Exumas. We're coming into Georgetown. And then we arrive in Georgetown for our second visit. It's not very many this boats, time but is one of the first cruiser boats of the season. So stay tuned. Behind Derby Island, just south of David Copperfield's island, Musha Key, are the Pimlico Keys and a very shallow channel that winds its way from Rudder Cut to Norman's Pond Key. Not for the faint of heart or deeper draft boats with depths at times of one meter or three feet. Things got very anxious for us as the depth sounder read depths of 2.5 and as we previously found out, when our depth sounder reads 2.4, we're touching the bottom. Being a fairly remote area on the shallow brigantine banks, no one would be coming to our aid should we find ourselves stuck on a sandbar. These areas are labeled VPR on all charts, meaning visual piloting rules apply. Concentration, good navigation, and the sun overhead are a must to make it safely through here. And a rising tide adds a level of safety not to be missed. Well, let's try something different there. I'm gonna go for that shallow part here. Check it out. Two point nine. Yeah, look at it in here. We gotta stay tight to this little island here. South Pimlico, make a sharp right and hug it tight, and then we're home free. But it's tricky. You can see the line. I don't know if you can see that. I hope you can. Of the shifting sands and the shallow areas. And we hit 2.5 back there. So we probably had a couple inches under the keel. We hit at 2.4. A little nerve wracking. What's for lunch, honey? Oh, it's gourmet today. Scrambled egg, cucumbers, and homemade bread. Safely <laughs> past the Pimlico Keys, and after lunch, we drop anchor at Lee's Stocking Island. We jump in the dinghy and set off to hike Perry's Peak, the highest point in the Exumas. Okay, here we are at Perry's Peak, highest point in the Exumas. Well, not yet. Well, <laughs> the trailhead. We're on the lowest part of the highest part. Yeah, the lowest. Um, where's the trailhead? Over here.
Time to go, too many mosquitoes. And after our hike, a refreshing swim at this gorgeous Bahamian beach paradise. Just on a turning tide now, the tide's going out, so the current should be in our favor. We had 22 to 25 knots yesterday, and today we have one and a half to two knots of wind. What a difference 24 hours makes. Not exactly optimum for sailing, but nice sea conditions. We're gonna fish. So we're gonna throw out the lines, see if we can catch ourselves some dinner.
Cool. Are we gonna fish with ballyhoos today? Um, we'll try one line with ballyhoo and one line with the lure. Does it work good? Yeah, it works really good. What kind of fish are you gonna catch us today? I'd like the tuna. If I could put an order in, I'll take the mahi or a tuna. We have to go out quite a ways before we can make our turn south. Yeah. Are we on course? to be here. It'd be fun to watch the harbor swell from it looks like there's maybe a dozen boats or so. Check it out. So we're coming into Elizabeth Harbor at Georgetown. That's Hamburger Beach here. There's Monument Hill. These boats are anchored at the Monument Anchorage. You can see back in there, that's her hurricane hole and there's probably 25, 25 boats back inside there. Chat and chill beach. We're closer to the conch shack, hun. And we don't have the taxi going past us. I don't know if we're officially the first boat, but... We are. We're the official first cruisers of Georgetown. There's six, six boats out there. They're permanent. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> we're the keeners. We're the first ones that chat Ready. Chat and chill, ready. Where is everybody? What time is the volleyball start? Yeah. <laughs> what time is, is it yoga on tomorrow? <laughs> Have we yoga on the beach followed by water aerobics at 10 and volleyball at 2. Might only be four of us. Might only be four of us playing volleyball. 
next time on Trio. <laughs> Junkanoo. Gonna review you here. Halloween. Apparently there's a hurricane brewing over top of us that's supposed to... And hurricanes. Hit in the wee in Georgetown. Of the morning tonight. Trio travels! So stay tuned. <laughs> A sailing family's journey to countries around the world. Setting the sails for unforgettable adventures.